Mikey, what are you doing? I'm making the bed by myself like I do all the time. Oh, please. Hey, y'all. I'm Michael. And I'm Kelly. We've been planning and preparing to sell everything in our house that we can't fit into an RV for the last six years. After asking Michael what he wanted for his birthday and him telling me... All I want is just to be out of our house and into a motorhome. I knew I couldn't get us into our motorhome before his birthday, but I could get us into a small travel trailer. <laughs> Boy, was I surprised. So come along with us as we transition from a 2,780 square foot house my grandparents built in 1964 to a 31 foot travel trailer. Emotion and all, this is going to be quite an adventure. There's video out there somewhere of me making the bed by myself, but somehow that footage got mysteriously lost. Uh huh. Oh, you can't see it. It didn't really happen. Yeah, if you say so. How to get the corner tucked in? Yeah, it's not very easy, is it? I told you. No. Okay, let me get my well, side now. Well, one good thing about Georgetown when we get it. Yeah. We can tip the bed up. The head comes up. Oh, that's true. Yeah, it does. Tuck it in and lay it back down. Yeah, that's a plus. Yeah, this is not the easiest bed to make. Where are you going now? We're gonna do... We gotta get the wrinkles out. Well, I don't even have my... My side's not even made. See, I'll come over there and do it. Hold on. Oh, I'll yeah. Right there. Okay. Okay. Kelly, what are you doing now? Hey, don't be mooning everybody now. Kelly. I can't... It's a heavy mattress. What's I got to do with tucking a sheet in? Tuck it in, girl. Tuck it in. Tuck it in. <laughs> you can pull it up, but I can't. I didn't pull it up. I couldn't even pull it up. What do you mean I pulled it up? It's I hard. Pull it. I know. What if we pull? What if I... You need to pull. My pullers are, are shot. <laughs> Your pullers are shot? <laughs> yeah. Like... Your pullers are shot? <laughs> my pullers are shot. So, what if you... Pull or what? Pull or express? What if you pull it and then I tuck? Okay. Well, I can't be videoing it if we're going to do that. Yeah, hang up. Hang up. <laughs> oh, my hand out my left arm. Pull it up. Pull it up. What are you doing? See, like I said, I'm, oh, I'm making a bed by my hand. I've done been up there. We've got video proof this time. <laughs> Why can't you just pull it up? I know I can't pull it up, but you got bigger muscles than me. Muscles ain't got nothing to do with it. I ain't got, you ain't got no leverage to pull it. it yeah, it's, it's a heavy mattress. It's memory foam and it's pretty thick. One of my least favorite things about living in our tiny space is our bed making. So far, I don't like making the bed. Even with Michael helping me, it's just a pain because our bed is sandwiched between two wardrobes and it's just a pain. So I saw on one of the full-time RV sites, somebody mentioned Betty's, not Betty, Betty's, B-E-D-D-Y-S. I thought, okay, let's give it a try because once you get it made for the first for the first day of the week, um, all you have to do is zip it up to make you know tuck your sheet in and then zip it up. Well, my Betty came today. I went ahead. I actually ended up getting a special, so they were fifty percent off. I think now I got I got two that had been discontinued, um, but I wanted the ones that were discontinued because the new the new ones that came out were were cute, but I just. I liked the discontinued ones better. So I ended up getting two for almost what I would have paid for one. So I got one queen size that will fit our tiny home we're in now, our Cherokee. And then I got a king size because when we get our Georgetown, it's gonna have a king size bed. So I thought, well, why don't I just go ahead and get two since they're so cheap. And then I'll have one when we get our Georgetown. So I'm super excited guys. So here, I'm gonna turn around and open it up with you. So here it is, zip your bed, Betty's. I got the chick, 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 whatever, chick white. I'm a little nervous about having white with puppies, but we keep a blanket on the bed and I'm just gonna have to make sure maybe that they don't, hopefully they'll lay on the blanket. I might put two blankets on the bed so that they, cause they like sleeping under covers. So I was thinking, well, maybe if I put two, two blankets, they'll sleep 
on the blanket and not the the comforter white white makes me nervous my mom has a white comforter on her bed and she seems to like it so and she has a puppy let's open it and see what's in here so, um it come with an instruction card and it says to to wash for the first time put a cup of white vinegar in it to help set the color I don't think with white I need to set the color it's super soft y'all oh my gosh it's soft and it's fluffy I love fluffy the only thing I'm nervous about is that I'm gonna be hot because I'm hot natured and I kick my comf I kick the comforter off and just have the sheet and this with this, it's the comforter and the sheet together. So it actually zips all the way around. It'll unzip and it says for the for washing it that I need to separate it. So let's pull it out and see, gosh. Oh, it came with pillowcases and shams. Oh, how cool. I love it so far. Oh, it's super soft though. But I got the Minky, which is a blanket inside instead of a sheet um they've got all cotton or they have minky so oh that is soft I'm trying to do this one-handed because i don't have my i don't have my mikey to help me out oh that's cool i really like this a lot that's super soft y'all oh i'm glad i got the minky it's it feels like a down maybe um comforter it's it's really this feels like it's gonna be super cozy so yeah i'm gonna take it down to the laundry and wash it and then i'll come back when it's time to put it on show y'all how to get it on yay i'm excited what you got there, Kelly? Mm, my Betty. It's amazing. How amazing is it? Well, it cuts making the bed more than in half because all you got to do is zip, zip, and you're done. Whereas before, we were fighting the covers every morning because the comforter and the top sheet would slide down, and you got to pull it up, and then you got to make sure we had eight lines on this side eight lines on that side and then you gotta fix it up there and your sheet was coming out now all we have to do is zip zip so after the initial getting it on it's lovely <laughs> it's just getting it on so this is only the second time we've had to put it on so we've had it what two weeks now has it been that long yeah, we didn't do our sheets last week because we were in Tennessee. Yeah. So <laughs> that's why we, it was two weeks. So usually we do our sheets every week. Um, but I was trying to find the zipper. All you got to do is find like where it zips on. You have to unzip it, take the top off when you wash it. And then it said the first time you wash it, put in a cup of white vinegar but we didn't do that because it's white we have a gray one for our king size bed um, when we get our George town Georgetown. yeah that one we'll probably put that in there but this time um, so we wash them separately and then dry them on low not the high heat What's the... Was it knit something? I can't remember. I got to be foggy still really bad. <laughs> but it's just the initial getting it on there. Here we go. Do you need help or are you just going to... I got it on the camera. Oh, ay, ay, ay. It's fucking here. <laughs> well, I know I've always found it easier to do what she's doing right there. Get the corner of that all up there. Don't put it on the foot yet. Leave it there, put it on up there, and then bring it down. But that way you ain't gotta, to... you ain't gotta fight stretching it. <coughs> oh my God, what are you doing? I'm trying to pull it 
Ain't time to go to bed yet. <laughs> but I want it like right here. Yeah. Like it is a little harder to put on because it's thicker. But it's after you get it on, it's lovely. Really, don't let this. You, know, you want me to do my side now? Uh, let me put this why down so I can do my side. Why don't you show me how you do it? Okay, let's see if he can do it better than me. <laughs> there ain't but one way to do it to put it on. But I can't get the mattress lifted up. That's my problem. I'll pull the zipper down. Yeah, I'll tuck that in there. Here's the fitted part of it right yeah there. so it's pretty big it's big enough to get it down in there i just like to try to pull the, sh the mattress well, up what so if you do it inside out oh that's, that's a great idea Put it on the corner but we didn't have a pro like with our other sheets we had a problem with the fitted sheet coming off sometimes this one once you get it on there it it's fit just perfectly so that you don't have to worry about it coming undone this is not one thing about this mattress it's not a regular rv mattress yeah the people we bought it from put a, it's a really one. really uh, good we'll, we'll, mattress we'll, 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 but i don't know but it's it's amazing it's so it's so comfy it's about eight inches thick yeah okay let me fix my side because yours looks good Mine doesn't um, look that good. Once you get the sides done, it's just like any other fitted sheet. Okay, let me ask you something. This might, I hope this don't bring a trigger. Trigger for what? Because Mikey, <laughs> I love you. Mikey. Uh, I hate when she says that. Mikey didn't see a need for this. This was something I really did a lot of research on. I saw one of the, the couples that we follow. Oh, you're gonna ask me. They had them. Mikey said, I don't see a need for that. I, don't, I, I really don't think we need it. But it's very, very, very rare that if he says, well, I don't see a need in that, that I would just go right ahead and do it anyway. But I did with this. Really? <laughs> I love you. Really? There's, no, there, there's nothing else I say to worry about me and me for it? You not, don't do it? Not really? usually. I mean, really? I don't usually go past what you, you know. I mean, we're a team. But... Having it now, are you glad that we went ahead and got it? Because we actually got two for the price of one. We it was buy well, one get one fifty per it, it was buy one get one fifty percent off. But this one was discontinued, which I love it. I didn't care if it was discontinued because this is the one that I wanted. So we we pretty basically got two for the price of one. So are you glad that I went ahead and did it? Because I mean seeing how easy it is now to make the bed in the morning all i gotta do is up it up yeah but one thing about it is i've got a little flap that comes out on the on the like on the yes the top sheet and the comforter is all one but they got a little flap that comes out to cover up for the stuff that's supposedly hanging over mm -hmm. not enough of that hangover no it's not it, it could, that could be long because <laughs> well that's only because our puppies take our covers yeah. i mean that's a problem it really is but i mean it's okay but yeah, they do take our, our covers. So let me see if I can fix mine as good. Look how good that is. He did such a better job than I did. <laughs> Yours looks so much better. You want to come do my side now? No, you have to learn how to do yours. Gosh, sugar. Are you going to do like I did? Yeah, because mine's Hold on, it. Pull the corner. Even... Pull the corner. There you go. Just like that. No, that's not what I did. What did you, what did you do? You stuck that there and pushed this under, right? Tuck it under. Yeah, that's what you did, right? <laughs> I don't like to make the bed. Not my favorite well, part of living here. Make sure you have the very bottom part of the sheet that goes under the mattress when you're doing that, too. You, you ain't got to do all that. I didn't have to do all that. <laughs> I just tucked it under. No, but I can't get it under there. Okay. Oh, Lord. oh yeah, that's good. <laughs> that's great. I did that good. Yeah. Yeah, see, it fits tight so it doesn't come out. Y'all see her nightgown in her. 
robe huh? there. That's not my nightgown, that's my robes. Oh, they're both two robes? Yeah, winter robe, summer robe. Where are you going? <laughs> Kelly, where are you going? Oh, she's bringing in the, uh, and the bed so spread. And it's so fluffy. That's what I love about it. It's so fluffy and soft and... The sheets like, are kind of like, what do you call them? Well, we Nobby? What do they call that? We got the minky. So you can get all cotton or you can get minky, which is kind of like a blanket. And I thought for for winter, it would be, well, I wanted I wanted this one to be the all cotton, but they were sold out by the time I completely decided to go against what you told me. <laughs> they sold out. So we got the minky on both. <laughs> so, because they have a light feel which is what I really wanted. I had it in the cart and then when I talked to you about it and you said, I don't think we really need it. It all sold out before I could get it, but I'm glad that it did because I like the full feel because it is so soft. Like I love climbing in bed at night now because oh, it's just- is, it, is that what you do at night time? You, you just yeah, rub it at get night in, time? And I'm just, because <laughs> it's so soft. <laughs> I'm back to my childhood when I need something to- Charlie <laughs> can't. Yeah. And you suck on that too? No. You, you suck on the corner of the... No. That was my sister. I didn't suck my thumb. I didn't say that. <laughs> didn't you used to suck on Charlie? No, you used to rub Charlie Cat's ear, didn't you? Yeah. No, that's what I'm okay. That's what I meant. So now you rub it. So you have a zipper and it's easy to find, but that's hidden. I mean, you don't, you don't really see it. It just helps you find it. So yeah, you, you got this, this. But here's how. You've got this, you got this ruffle right here that hides the zipper. Yeah. It folds over Show like that. The, Show them the part that comes out, though. What you were saying comes out. This piece right here. Yeah, this is so the part that comes out. out. This right here is the part that hangs out. You tuck it under. You tuck it under when you're going to um, zip it up. And then when you go to bed, you pull that over and it hangs over the edge of the mattress. Looks like your covers. I was afraid that it would be hot, but it's really not that hot. Okay. The thing so, here. Bring this Kelly's, to the end. Kelly's actually got, she's got, if you notice, it's just like a zipper. It's opposite ends here. Yeah, it's backwards. Where's your zipper? My zipper's up there. Her, mm -hmm. her, the, the cover has got her, I don't know what you call it, because that'd be the female version of the zipper. Yeah. And then you just hook it on. Make sure you get it to the end, because I met the zip the first time I did it. And another thing I've noticed is when you're zipping, you gotta be careful you don't get the ruffle stuck in there. Yeah. Or that little flap when you're closing it up. Mm -hmm. Ooh, that's how we make the bed every morning. I'm just gonna tighten the covers, and I don't zip mine all the way up. I zip it to about right there. Because it's hard for me to get up in there and get it unzipped in the mornings or in the evening. So I don't even zip mine off. So I stop mine about, actually right about there. So I don't have to get up in here to unzip it every night. So it'll be like, a, right it'll be like a pain in the butt trying to get into bed like it is making the bed. Yes, huh? and I don't want that. So I just zip it to right there. You can't tell that I didn't zip it all the no. way up because I pull it up. And then all I have to do to get in bed is find my zipper. I unzip. And I don't, like you can unzip it as far as you want. I unzip to about right there. I pull out my, my, my little blankie. Climb in the bed. Here we go. See? Ah, it's so comfy. I love it. <laughs> what the flap looks like underneath. That hangs out when you get the bed made up. Or unmade when you unmake the bed. So isn't that much easier, Mikey? Yeah, it's easier when you get in the bed. So, so I was right? Because most of the time in the morning, I make the bed myself. Right, so technically I was trying to make it easier on you. Yeah. On and why do you. I make the bed myself? Because I'm not a morning person. Well, we don't have to tell everybody that, but I'm just not a morning person and you get me up just in time to go. Oh, so I can get you up earlier? No, I didn't say that. It is easier. And I was right. So see how pretty yeah. it is? You gotta get all these wrinkles. You ain't gotta worry about getting all these wrinkles out because they're, they're made in wrinkles. Yeah. <laughs>
and Mikey said tell everybody that this is not stains that you see on it it's our it's our lighting I came in here yesterday and I was freaking out because I thought why has it got stains all over it no, that's from the LED lights yeah, stuff we, on top but the stuff on the on the corner down there why it looks so yellow yeah that's from the LED lights out there in the living room yeah <laughs> but I thought that too I'm thinking oh my lord but when, when you pulled it the stain moved yeah I'm sorry the stain didn't move when you hold it, it's just from the LED lights. Right. So this is it make, made up. We just add our pillows and our blankets. And our puppy dogs. And our puppies. Well, we don't leave them when we make the bed. We we add them at nighttime. This is our beddy spread on our bed. Yes, I love poo. Yes, I have two poos, both which Mikey gave me. Um, so far, I love it. All we have to do is zip, zip, and our bed is made. It's amazing. It is so comfy. It's very um, cushy, fluffy, and I absolutely love it. Wish we had bought it the first week we were in here so that we didn't have to fight with the making of the bed every day. Now it's just once a week. It wasn't too hard to get on. I mean, no harder than putting a fitted sheet on. But now when we make our bed, we're not having to pull the spread because it's slipped down. Um, I zip my, I unzip my side all the way down because I like taking my feet out of the covers. I don't want to be bundled up. You don't, you can, you can unzip it as much as you want, but I unzip mine all the way so that I can get out of the covers if I need to. We haven't had any problems of it coming off the bed. It's staying on there very good on the corners. Um, you can see it's fitted around the corners. So we haven't had any problems of it slipping off or popping up. But yeah, I definitely would recommend if you have a camper, you don't like making your bed. If you don't like making your RV bed, this is what you need, beddies. Do they make them for regular beds? Yeah. If you don't like making any bed, evidently you can. Right. I think she created it. The girl that created it created it for her kids because. You don't like making the bed. Yeah. And their covers would end off the bed every night, and so we'll put a link down below of how you can order one. Alrighty um, then. Until that time, we'll go to bed. Take y'all. Well, we won't see them then. This is the end of this video. <laughs> <laughs> Until next time, see you. Bye, friends. Be blessed.